The Xbox One X has arrived and has earned its place as the most powerful gaming console ever. Launching at the beginning of November means it reached customers just ahead of the holiday shopping season. Now Black Friday is upon us and fans of the new system are eagerly anticipating the opportunity to add a few cool extras to this beastly system. We've put together a quick list of some great cheap accessories for your Xbox One X that you can score during the Black Friday sale. Sorry, but bidding on that Project Scorpio edition you found on eBay won't be on our list. Not for lack of trying, though. Nobody listens to me. Hey, before you finish that last bite of turkey, make sure to like this video and subscribe to The Gamer so you can stay up to date with all of our amazing videos. Without further ado, here are five of the best new Xbox One accessories under $25. Custom Skins There have been a dizzying number of special edition Xboxes released over the years. The OG Xbox had the green Halo edition and an even greener Mountain Dew edition. For the 360, there were even more Halo editions, Gears of War, and even a very cool Star Wars version. For the Xbox One S, the Minecraft bundle was certainly eye-catching. While the One X and the Project Scorpio edition have even sleeker designs, there are of course plenty of customization options for how it looks as well. Sure, custom skins are nothing new and the One X is already a beautiful looking system, but the sheer variety, affordability and ease of use makes customizing your console to make it your own undeniably appealing. I'm gonna get a PlayStation skin for my One X and piss off all of my friends. <laughs> Wannabe Scorpio Vertical Stands The Project Scorpio edition of the Xbox One X is exactly the same as the regular One X when it comes to the internal components. It's the Project Scorpio's exterior design that sets it apart. One notable difference is that it comes with a vertical stand. Luckily, there are a few different options for those who didn't score the Scorpio but still want to display their One X vertically. While the Xbox One X is remarkably small in size, a vertical stand is worth its weight in gold when it comes to saving a little real estate. There are a few different manufacturers producing these for the regular Xbox One X, and they range in price from around 10 to 15 bucks and are all similar looking, though the brand J and Topps design is a bit more interesting than the standard rectangular stands the other guys make. It's one of the higher priced options we found on Amazon for $15. There are also more expensive vertical stands that include more features like game box racks, cooling fans, controller bays, cup holder, hot pocket dispenser. Okay, those last two are personal projects. But the simple ones under $25 are actually closer in design to the official Project Scorpio stand. Oh, and one last thing we thought we'd better mention, the vertical stands for the previous versions of the Xbox One won't work with the One X and vice versa, so make sure that the stand that you get is designed specifically for the One X. Media Remotes Okay, this one might be considered cheating because they weren't designed specifically for the Xbox One X, but it could be argued that with the console's enhanced multimedia capabilities like the Ultra HD Blu-ray player, 4K streaming apps like Netflix, and its ability to record gameplay at 4K resolution, the media remotes for the Xbox One were made in anticipation of the One X. At the very least, a media remote control is definitely a must-have accessory for anyone who even <clears throat> remotely intends on doing anything other than gaming with their box. Why'd I even say that? I hate puns. Ugh. There's the Microsoft OEM remote for the Xbox One, and it has all the basic necessities you would need from a media remote. It's also arguably the most popular choice. With the lack of a Kinect included with the Xbox One X, Microsoft offers up this remote to fill that role. It can be found right at $25 at many retailers. There are, however, multiple third-party remotes available too, and these all list prices in the low teens. Out of these, the PDP Talon is the one we'd recommend for Xbox One X users. Coming in at the $15 mark, it has a similar material design to the official remote, but boasts a full-sized, more traditional media remote shape. It also has a full set of channel buttons and extended features compared to the smaller OEM option, which complements the heightened media experience on the Xbox One X. Both the official remote and the Talon feature motion-sensitive, backlit buttons so you can see what you're pressing in your middle-of-the-night viewing pleasure. Play and Charge Kit 
Okay, here's another accessory that, while not an Xbox One exclusive, is an absolute must-have for any owner of the console. This is a touchy topic for a lot of players, because the console ships with two AA batteries for the controller, which seems a bit antiquated compared to all the other new tech shoved into the One X. I haven't bought batteries in about seven years. That doesn't mean I don't need them. They've been on my shopping list for seven years. I'm really bad at shopping. Enter the Play and Charge Kit. Clocking in at the $25 price point, it consists of a self-contained rechargeable battery pack that replaces the standard AA's and a charging cable which allows continued use of the controller while it's charging. Again, this isn't anything new and there are a ton of options when it comes to controller docking stations, but the Xbox Play and Charge Kit has always proven to be one of the most affordable, reliable, and trusted methods of keeping those gamepads ready for the fight. The included charging cable is 9 feet in length, and after the initial setup in the dashboard menu, the accessory lives up to its name. You literally just play and charge. Xbox Game Pass Microsoft rolled out the Xbox Game Pass earlier this year ahead of the launch of the Xbox One X, and it's a full-featured game subscription service. It allows access to Xbox Live Arcade, Xbox 360, and Xbox One titles, including some of the biggest games in the Xbox lineup, including Halo 5 and the Gears of War series. One cool thing to consider is the availability of many smaller titles that the subscription service offers. The awesome Capcom Arcade Classic Final Fight Double Impact, the unique and endearing Brothers, or all the titles included in the Sega Vintage Collection are available through the service. The Xbox One X comes packaged with a free trial period for the service, and many players who took advantage of this will be looking to continue reaping the benefits of Game Pass once the trial is up. The regular price for the subscription plan is 10 bucks a month, and even if you only take advantage of just a few titles every month, the cost becomes very reasonable. 10 bucks a month! That's like nothing! How am I supposed to balance a job and playtime now? One thing to consider is that you don't need an Xbox Live Gold membership to have access to the service, but you would need the membership to play any online multiplayer games. So there you go. We hope you haven't succumbed to tryptophan-induced slumber before you can get a hold of these awesome accessories for your Xbox One X. Are you planning on enhancing your One X experience with any of these choices? Do you know of any great add-ons for less than $25 that we might have missed? Let us know in the comments section below, and be sure to subscribe to The Gamer for more turkey-licious gaming content. That sounds disgusting, I'm, I'm so sorry for the image. Anyway, thanks for watching.